Hey, it's Kim here, back with another R4 video, and this time I'm going to show you how to put the latest firmware onto your microSD card for the R4, so it won't have that forever loading screen again. First of all, open up Google. I'm typing www.r4dsl.net. Click on the second link. This is the actual page for the R4 version 3 upgrade. So it's like it's a it's a clone but not the actual one. And it still works great. Go to downloads. Scroll down and here's the kernels. The latest is version 3.8 and just choose your preferred language, mine's English. You can choose any of the download mirrors. By the way, you need WinRAR, you can go on the website and get a free download. And then go and save and just save it anywhere. Save it to your desktop. But since I've already got this, I don't need to do this. So you cancel it, close that down, and you'll have this. And what you do is go and right click and extract here, and that'll extract all the files. These are the files you get, all these six. And you need these six to put onto the SD card so it will it'll run. So what we need to do now is to take the SD card and put it into your trans flash card reader. It goes in there and then USB. But since I have a little part there for SD cards, I'm just going to pop it back into the little adapter it came with. You guys might not be able to do this. And I pop it into there. For the people who don't have this, all you do is just take your card, put it in there, put in the USB slot there. Now we're ready to go. Right, we're back to the laptop, and you should open to view folders and files. And here, the, it'll be empty, there'll be nothing there at all. So what you need to do, you need to go where you saved the kernel, everything in there, and there's six items here. What you need to do is drag these six items onto here. But I've already done that, so there's no need to do that. And you just have those in there, besides one folder, and that'll be games. Yeah, so those six there, and what you do is create a new folder and just call it games. And there you go. Also, you can add music, but I'll show you that in a different video. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. You just click and drag that over. Computer safely remove take your SD card out of the adapter put it into the air file and you're good to go good to go now when you put your R4 into the DS and turn it on it'll go past the loading screen and you'll have something that maybe look like this depends on what month it's on then you can go on to your different files you can go to Moonshell that's games yeah so it's working everything, watch my new video, well, next video, on how to get games and the iPod.